All right. Uh, so what do we do? We've got we've got this door. Uh, I guess this is yeah. This would be the second episode. Things might be a little bit different. I started over, so the good people watching the stream wouldn't be too confused. Uh, let's see. I'm. I'd be interesting to play. Oh. Okay. Okay. Assumption is... We got it? We got it. Okay. Uh, assumption is we have to get both buttons without getting shot here. Not so hard. I'm gonna keep wandering around for a bit. I'm hearing there's fireballs here. I... Ow! What? What? Oh. I don't think I'm going to be able to do much to this guy. Oh, right, I forgot I had turned on the uh, the difficulty so we could speed through this. Let's let's turn it back up, I think. Ga game options, game options, up to normal. There we go. Now we're at the the right point, and let's, let's actually start taking this seriously. Mostly seriously. So what do we got in here? Oh, damn. Okay, basic servo booster, a hunter shotgun, a crude warhammer. Let's take all and let's figure out, well, let's listen to the thing and I'll manage my inventory while this happens. Such fond memories of my study years. The Bureau had granted me a scholarship, which I gladly repaid by pledging to work in the Arxvaporum for a seven-year term. My dreams came true. When I first arrived on Capital Island, coming from my home at Garion Islet, the astonishing sight of the labs, workshops, and all the machinery took me by storm. It was like Christmas trees covered with shiny cogs instead of balls and ornaments. It was heaven. Lots of folks grumble at the Bureau nowadays for silencing the critics and abusing power, supposedly. In my eyes, the Bureau is doing it right. Technology, order, and science should all be at the heart of society. I am where I am today, amidst the pioneers of the world, only thanks to the Supreme Bureau. Huh. What a nerd. Okay, so more damage, a lot more damage. Three second, oh, three second cooldown. Oh, nope, we don't want to do that. Back to the shield. Okay, we do also have a hunter shotgun. Uses two ammo. Tower range, cooldown. Shotguns deal damage in a cone in a short distance. Full damage, close range, reduce damage further away. Have a chance to stun enemies. I don't think I'm going to mess with that, but we do have the servo booster, so extra melee speed for a little while. Okay. It might be useful. Personally, I think I'm I'm leaning for the lightning just because. Does set two switch armor as well? Sadly, no. It just switches what you've got equipped, and nothing more. Okay, so we've got some kind of weird uh, flamethrower nonsense here. So maybe. Oh yeah, we got a brick. Oh, maybe let's take the brick. I'm going to bring the brick up here. Yep, there's our answer. Of course, now we've got a fireball coming through. You know, I'm just going to leave the brick there. I was, I was tempted to retrieve said brick and... I might have to retrieve said brick. Eh. There might be a proper way through. Let's wait for the... Okay, there we go. I don't want to get hit by the fireball. I need this brick, though. I guess the door is already open, so we don't have to worry about it too bad. Okay. No, nope, it's not tab. It's C. C to pull out your inventory. Hopefully they give us a whole supply of... What? Oh, maybe I have to... Um... Maybe it's this one. Or maybe I have to weight both of them down. Okay. I kind of understand. Unfortunately, I'm not getting that I'm not getting that prick back for a while. What's this one? Aim stabilizer. Not 
probably that useful. Not for what I'm doing. Let's see. Well, we might as well try that. Never mind. I was like, yeah, let's go with the uh, the melee attack speed booster. Let's let's see what happens when I do that. The answer is nope. Never mind. Doesn't doesn't do jack. Enemies just die. Yeah, so if I can get my uh, energy recharge and ability recharge to be even faster, we could be able to just like burn through things real quick. Okay, so that's this is new. Hopefully we can find a key somewhere around here. Oh. Okay, so that raises the water level. Yeah, so we need a key to get through there. Nothing on that. I must have missed a chest. Oh. Ah. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, these things are... Ow. Okay. I really have to cheese them to rotate properly. I can't, like, try and time their cannon shots. They will just... They will just shoot me. How durable are these things? Okay, well, there's... there's one down. Uh, let's see. I can kind of get this dance down. There's... there's a very easy, like, dance you could do. If you, like, really knew what you were doing on this, you could really just, like, zip around everybody freely. Well, recruit Bone Crusher. Oh, I could have put on the sledgehammer now that I'm thinking... now that I'm thinking about it. Like, that actually would have worked really well. Circuits! Okay. Oh, I gotta be level 4 to get the Thama Catalyzer. Well, that's fine. If I do Fusion Conversion, we get a higher energy regen. It's probably worth it. I'm just gonna focus on, on casting at all times. Yeah, how do you miss a punch at a stationary object? If you ever tried punching a tree, sometimes you just miss. Those trees are wily. Dr. Wily. I really wanna watch like a, a really like over-dramatized Mega Man at some point. Except for I really don't. It'd just be fun. I guess there was that, uh, what's it, Kassan? No. Cat, cat, Kassern. They, there was like a really weird kind of pseudo Mega Man, uh, live action, uh, Japanese movie once. I was like so excited to watch it, and then it turns out it was like pure garbage. Oh, right, I had been looking at this sucker. Oh, I do have a gun. Damn it. What's the range on this thing? Three tile range, two tile range, four tile range. Lieutenant rifle or I had another rifle, right? Footman pistol, shotgun. No, I guess it's the rifle. Okay. Still nothing. Yeah, I want to lead with a shot. How? One, two. Three, oh, four. Okay. I'm just gonna go with uh, high speed damage on this guy and then G. G. You really do not get a whole lot of time to get out of there. Well, that's okay. I do not like those guys. Not one bit. But then again, I've been pretty good at, uh, about not taking damage so far, so I guess we can deal with, like, a little bit. No, no, like, weird switch lever things. It, it feels like there's less, like, weird hidden rocks in this game than there, than there have been. Ow! Did I get him? I got him. That was effective. Do we have any, like, weird baggies on the floor? The answer is no. I need a I'm, key. I'm hoping we get, like, some kind of healing spell later. Okay. Are they done? Or are they still trading fireballs? Oh, no, we turned this one off. Ow. 
not having the greatest time on this, but that that's... Uh, we'll be okay. We'll be okay. This game hurts. Right, let's take our brick. Let's see what else we got here. Throwing. You can drop any item you find obsolete under the ground, or you can throw items into the distance. How? I'm gonna save. Thanks. I... Let's go back. What was that? Okay, I can throw it. What does that do? Oh. I'm supposed to throw it at that one. I thought it, I thought it was like implying I could hit the switch with a brick, and I was like, that's impressive, but I mean not that insane. Soulmate. My foreman, Mr. Bench, seems like a decent fella. He has a good sense of humor and all that, but I can't let him get too close to me. Can't let anyone get too close to me, not after losing my soulmate, Lisa. She was so bright and warm. Only she got her nose too deep into the Fumium research. I did warn her, but she couldn't. She just wouldn't listen. So now I've dedicated myself to my work. Work and nothing else. Keeps me occupied and keeps the blues at bay. We've also got this here. Ooh, rusty helmet and worker gloves. The worker gloves is better than what I got? Nope. Today is the most beautiful day in my life. I found out that I'm pregnant. Marcus and I will have a baby. But still, raising a child here in the tower, I'm not sure how I feel about that. I will have to protect it from the effects of the Fumium. The thing is, I'm starting to doubt that we really know anything about its power or influence. I'm pretty sure, though, that if it proves to be dangerous to the baby, Marcus and I will go back to the Capital Island. We'll be a family, and that's much more important than any research or benefits from the Bureau. Okay, so we got everything. We got the key. We got another mace. Let me see. So we had that, like, weird pit. But I think we're headed... Here? Golden key. Alright. So I wanted to take a look at this fireball nonsense. No, it doesn't look like there's any way that I can turn off this fireball on the side. It, uh, did a lot of harm. <laughs> did a lot of harm. Yep. Okay. Just gonna dance around. My main goal is to kill this thing with... Uh... Huh. Okay, that door doesn't open for some reason. My main goal is to to kill enemies with as little actually direct melee combat as possible. I okay, it's open. I don't really understand how half these like pressure pads are exactly designed to work, but it's kind of one of those where questioning it, questioning it is silly. Ooh, basic blowtorch. Unleash a wave of fire in a line, dealing damage to enemies hit and administering burning on them. Uh, let's see, it's a two-tile range. Well, let's get rid of the melee thing, because that is this is way better. Roachling. We discovered cockroaches here in Artsman Porum. They must have found their way in here with the supplies of fruit and vegetables. We quickly decided to eradicate them, but then Laura stepped in with a bold idea. Let's use them for research. We needed Fumium-enhanced fruit hash to... Oh, we fed Fumium-enhanced fruit hash to these pesky little creatures. Well, little. They're growing fast. We had to build holding cells for them as they started to lash out at us. Very agile, quick, and hard to contain. I just hope these roachlings don't become too strong to break out of the cells. Observing their growth and behavior is marvelous, but their risks we cannot foresee, I'm afraid. Jane Shahane. Shane? Jane Shane. Substance field assistant. Burning effect. Okay, so they just take damage. But yeah, so I can I can set stuff on fire now. And it's pretty cheap, too. If we can eventually get four uh, pretty hefty spells, I will be a happy camper. Ah. Load last save? Oh, you motherfuck. Ah. Turns out something about what I did reset the, uh, well... Now we get to listen to the audio log again. Today is the or not. Okay. Well. Note to self. Quick save more often. Like always. A at least it really doesn't set us back too far. But it's annoying. Okay. 
So we're just going to electrify the bug and then just dance around him while we wait for more electricity. Poor bug. I assume this is supposed to be the cockroach. I assume. Okay. Is Wander just smacking buttons? I don't really have a choice. Sometimes, like, interacting with them is kind of awkward. Okay, so let's let's save. We know... We know there's some stuff here. Uh, let's equip the fire. Now, if I do that... Okay, so there's a door somewhere. Okay, so that does that. Well, at least this isn't reset. Uh Okay, so I have to I have to more or less like do weird strafing nonsense. There we go. Got it. Oh, why did that? Oh, that opened. Oh. Oh, because that door's open up now. Opened up now. I don't entirely know how to get there. Can you shoot buttons? I wish he could. It'd actually help, but it'll also. Ah, you dick. As not a creature that I enjoy the uh, presence of. Okay, there. Ow! Why did I do that? Oh, I forgot that I was there. These things hurt. Let's keep going. They like to surprise me with them, too. They're all over the place. Alright, so what do we get? We get basic protector. Uh, reduces damage from everything and nothing that interesting. Acid roach. Although the population of roaches did not originally possess any form of acidic attack, some have now developed a strong spitting mechanism inside their mandibles. The ball of spit tends to burst into a pool of acid upon impact. Very toxic with a possible long-lasting effect, long effects on health. I believe this has to do with diet, as we feed each group a different variant of fumium-based food. I'll need to get more statistical data on this to be sure. Chain chain. And acid effect. Oh! Hurts their healing abilities for a little while. Okay, and then otherwise we get some rope, which is apparently a quest item. Oh boy, that's going to be... I, I'm not entirely sure what, what that's going to entail. Well, where does this put me? I guess let's just loop, loop around. You think you could, like, crawl in there? Uh, maybe you don't really want to crawl into a roach hole. I mean, maybe you do. So that raises the water a little bit more. I'm not entirely sure. Be safe to cross now. I'm not entirely sure why that door closed on me. Uh, yeah. So we want to go. We want to go through here. We had. So we have that door, but we also have this door here. So let's let's go for that first. Because there was something over here. Through here? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's whatever this is. Secret found. Not really that secret. Okay, I'm gonna save. This seems like a uh, roach town. Alright, so we get ourselves a marauder chest piece. Adds a portion of your max integrity as bonus damage to your weapon attacks. Oh, that actually sounds really good. Okay. I can't do much about him. And we're blocked in here. Did I kill the did I kill the acid ones? I might have. Alright, well we might as well heal up at this point. Those uh they were me those guys are mean. But that's that's the extent of it. So what's this do? Oh. Oh, that extends us back here? So now we're just back. Oh, I guess we did actually get a reward. 
I mean, to be fair, EXP of any variety is a reward. Right, we also got whatever this is. Toughness Fuse. Oh, that just gives me bonus toughness. Okay, sure. So, extra toughness and evasion? I don't know. Attack is energy and gadget damage and all weapon damage and precision. Okay. Yeah, hopefully we can get some more caster items soon. Getting a heavy... Heavy armor is like it's tempting, but I know it's not it's not gonna work for me. Is this a mod? No, this is actually a completely different game. This is not uh Legend of Grimrock. Unfortunately, uh the developers do not have it listed on Twitch. So I am uh I'm masquerading. Uh I'm masquerading this game I need a key. as something that it's not. I wonder if we get to sell anything at some point. Or if I just should get rid of my old items. Like, uh, I need some string or something like it to tie the pieces together. So this is going to be single person as opposed to. What the? Wow, that is pretty impressive how he how he managed to get that put together. But yes, this is a single guy as opposed to a, a whole party of people like in Grimrock. Which I think is kind of better, maybe. Uh, at least it's a, a little bit easier for me to get around and manage, because Grimrock always felt like I was juggling and I didn't like it. This this feels less awkward. We have arrived. Finally, our new home here at the Arcs of Aporum. I'm impressed by what the Bureau has accomplished. It's gargantuan. Can't wait to unpack and start working. Being stranded here in the middle of the ocean like this worries me a little, but the tower feels strong and safe. I'm pretty sure no cut Kenyut will repeat ever again. The research on the Fumium shows promise. Maybe I'm dreaming here, but it could just happen to be the next marvel of the world, and we'll be right in the thick of things. I'm so looking forward to taking over and continuing the project, and the best thing about it is the fusion of family and working life combined together. Okay. Yeah, this level's a bit longer. Oh, we're still... Oh, wait, no, no, no. We don't have the key for that door. So I know how to get through there. All right. Well, what do we got in this, on this end? Ow! I'm always waiting for the jerkish creatures to show up. Luckily, I can just throw spells at them and just kind of wail. They don't quite do enough damage though. But that's okay. Out of energy. Oh, we're bleeding. Don't move. Okay, that's a that's a bit better. I hope we get the ability to self-heal at some point. I would absolutely throw a spell spell slot at that. Ah, goody. More fireballs. Unless... No, this is new. We have not been here before. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, jeez. There we go. Okay. So that that gets us Jesus. This is mean. Oh, just to get a chest too. Well, hopefully it's got no no keys. Another great success. Today, the local coordinator for the bureau and chief officer of the Arcs, Marcus Reich, appointed me deputy foreman of manufacturing. I'll take care of workshops, maintenance, and manufacturing itself. I'm so proud that Mr. Reich recognized my accomplishments. He's a role model to me. Not only is he an experienced scientist and a veteran of the island wars against the rebels, he's also the ideal man for the job. An excellent choice by the Bureau to lead the project. He and his wife Laura are the perfect model of how I picture my life in the future. Um... That's nice, but I was really hoping I'd get a key or something. Oh. There's a button. How did I make that? I don't know. Uh, do we just go through the other door? I guess. I thought I was supposed to get a key from this area. Alright, whatever. Ah, shit. Mm. 
Is there another? There's another one. Okay. I'm gonna deal with the bleed damage for a second. And just do that. Okay, there we go. So... Did those guys just... Yeah, they just came out of nowhere. Okay, well that's fine. This hurts. Uh, do we... I heard like a weird chime in the background, so maybe we're actually done with whatever we're supposed to do there? Because we can't open that. We can't get that open. This doesn't have anything for us. Uh, have I missed something? Because we have this door over here. But this required a key. I need a key. Requires a Fumium key. Oh, we have a key. I need a key. No, that requires a special key. But we do have a key. Unfortunately, it's like kind of the stupid rust brown that everything else is in this game. Uh, it makes it a little bit harder to determine what's what in my inventory. I like steampunk. I like steampunk a lot, but um, generally the art styles associated with steampunk can't quite as can't quite separate themselves out from just like horrible, horrible grayness, and it sucks because like. Oh, now this is bad. I. Okay, so we have big old Chumbawambas. Well, I got a gun for a reason. Okay, that hurts. I should probably rely on fire. He's got friends. He's got a friend bug. Uh, but I'm out of energy. Well, he's coming this way. See you later, dude. Ow. Nope. No see you later. Set him on fire. Slow. I'm just gonna have to wail on this bug. Come on, die. Thank you. Nope, it didn't die. Okay, we don't want to go this way. Ah, uh, where's that bug? I don't know. Yeah, so we've made our way to the boss chamber. But I don't exactly appreciate it. Okay, how are you not dead yet? Okay, get away. Luckily, luckily big and, big and scary is very slow. So I can more or less just hit him with fire and then run. And there it goes. Okay, perfect. Hurt a bit, There's but no way that was human. Or was it? I'm not sure of anything now. Okay, so that I gives me key. a golden key. I have a gold golden key. There's a Fumium key that I'm supposed to get somewhere, but I might have to like backtrack for it or Oh, I might not even be able to go back. I'm not sure. Yeah, okay, so it looks like I missed some kind of secret area uh, to get into that. Uh, I missed some kind of key to get into that area. Uh, Kenya. So yeah, I don't know where it would be. There was something over here, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Eh, whatever. Doesn't matter. I always love steampunk, but I feel they unfortunately went from traditionally brass and copper to iron, steel, and steel and rock. Yeah. Maybe it'll get more fantastic as we go through the game. But, like, I want to see, like, crazy stuff. And, like, what I'm looking at here is just kind of a rusted out warehouse look with pipes and shit. And, like, what I really want is is something that, like, gets, gets like, really nutso. Like, the last thing I killed, it really didn't seem that human. There was flesh, yeah, but there was steel and whatever that blue stuff was. This place just feels so familiar, but... None of the vermin and scrap me tin men do. Okay. I was really hoping the, uh...
Let's see. Do lightning? Nope. Okay, I can get out of that. These guys suck. I'm hitting them with all of my spells and I'm still incapable of dealing with it. Ow. Okay. Is there a way to get my energy to come back faster? Maybe if I'm maybe if I'm walking back and forth. But yeah, I might actually have to I might actually have to turn down the uh the difficulty a little bit. Not because it's impossible, but just because I'm not good enough at like the the maneuvering and stuff in these games to like really make him work. Oh, and he was just sitting there waiting for me. Oh, but we level up. Okay, problem solved. And we get a basic acid nozzle. Invest circuit points into the Thoma Catalyzer or fusion, concert, uh, fusion Conversion. So that'll... Extra energy regen, extra recharge speed, extra check attack. Let's go extra energy regen. I think we need that more right now. Oh. Well, that increases the amount of EXP I get. Damage taken gains as an energy and a gadget slot. Both of those get me gadget slots. Okay, yeah, so we'll go along uh, the bottom route. If we're lucky, I can get that within a level or two. Uh, now, we could do Acid Nozzle. How much damage? 7 second Acid... So, 35 damage total. 25 damage. Yeah. I think the acid nozzle yeah, will be my third spell. Not immediately though. 